Hey everyone, welcome back to Volt China. Today, I want to talk about a car that honestly shocked me when I first saw its specs. A turning radius smaller than a Mini? Stable at 200 km per hour even after a tire blowout? 0 to 100 km per hour acceleration in 2.74 seconds? And a sunroof that can change color in just 0.1 seconds? Hold on, this isn't some concept car, it's the already launched ZGL6. What's even crazier is that this car, which combines stunning looks and impressive capabilities, has a starting price of just over 200,000 RMB. That's right. At this price point, you can own a car with million-level driving quality and safety features comparable to luxury cars worth millions. No wonder it garnered 30,000 pre-orders during its pre-sale period. In the next 10 minutes, I'll show you why the L6 might be the most underrated luxury electric car of the year. Whether you're a car enthusiast or planning to buy a car, this content is absolutely worth watching until the end. Trust me, after watching, you might rethink what value for money truly means. First, let's talk about the core breakthrough of the L6. It's brand new third generation electronic and electrical architecture. This may sound technical, but simply put, the L6 has a true central brain. In the past, Cars function like separate organs working independently, but the L6 operates like a human nervous system with a central brain and distributed reflex capabilities. For example, when your tire slips, a regular car sends signals to the central processor before returning instructions. The L6, however, reacts directly at the edge, like a human knee-jerk reflex, and is 5 to 10 times faster. This system uses gigabit Ethernet connections, increasing bandwidth by 1,000 times. What does this mean? Imagine upgrading from dial-up internet to fiber optic. That's the difference. Supported by this architecture, the L6's Link-C digital chassis 2.0 truly makes a car priced at just over 200,000 RMB drive like a million-dollar luxury vehicle. Let's look at the real-world data. On cobblestone roads, the L6's vibration curve is more centered and has smaller amplitudes than million-level electric cars. This isn't just marketing jargon. It's a tangible improvement in comfort. Its intelligent electronic damping can adjust 100 times per second. In the time it takes you to blink, the chassis has already changed its stiffness over a dozen times. The ramp test is even more impressive. When the car goes over a slope, regular vehicles are prone to losing control, while the L6 experiences less impact and better bounce suppression. This isn't just a comfort issue, it's a safety concern. Speaking of performance, the l 6s is four-wheel drive version is simply outrageous. Dual motors with 579 kilowatts, 800 newton meters of torque, and 0 to 100 kilometers per hour acceleration in 2.74 seconds. But what's more practical is its particularly wide peak torque range, delivering maximum torque at low RPMs, the most commonly used range in city driving. What does this mean? It means that when you need to overtake, a light press on the accelerator gives you instant power, allowing you to change lanes and overtake smoothly with full confidence. And the L6 isn't just fast. It knows how to harness this speed. Its digital traction control system reacts 5 to 10 times faster than traditional systems, like putting intelligent anti-slip chains on your tires. Even on icy roads, it can start steadily. Its braking performance is equally impressive. Stopping from 100 km per hour in just 33 meters, over a meter shorter than the benchmark luxury cars. What's more, after 10 consecutive brake tests, the braking distance only increased by 1.27 meters. This means that even when descending winding mountain roads with frequent braking, performance remains stable and reliable. Now we come to the part that shocked me the most. The L6's Linksy Tire Blowout Stability Control System. This isn't some common feature, but the first time such cutting-edge technology has been standard across the lineup in this price range. When a blowout occurs, the L6 can identify it in as fast as 200 milliseconds, and the rear-wheel steering responds in just 40 milliseconds, faster than a blink. It can instantly counteract vehicle yaw, with response speeds three times faster than standalone braking solutions. How exaggerated is the actual effect? Check out these extreme tests. Four-wheel blowout test. All four tires punctured, yet the vehicle still brakes steadily. 
Corner double wheel blowout. Regular cars would have flown off the corner, but the L6 holds its direction firmly. Blowout at 200 km per hour. At this speed, a blowout is usually disastrous. But the L6 still breaks safely. Professional media tests are even crazier. They conducted full load tests at 120 km per hour blowouts. Corner blowouts on wet roads, irregular surface blowouts, and even tests on epoxy flooring with friction coefficients second only to ice. In all scenarios, the L6 performed as if it were on rails. The L6's high-speed full scenario, AEB, automatic emergency braking, has been triggered over 97,000 times, avoiding nearly 100,000 potential collisions. Its operating range is 8 to 130 km per hour, covering almost all daily scenarios. Passive safety is equally uncompromising. The L6 meets the latest battery safety standards set for 2026, with a submarine grade, 10 longitudinal, and 10 transverse full loop, closed submarine cage structure using high strength boron steel. What impressed me most is its triple redundant door opening system. Door buttons, mechanical handles inside, usable even if the car loses power, and backup mechanical locks outside. The key power source for unlocking the doors is designed in the collision safe zone, ensuring the doors can unlock immediately after a crash. Gigi's slogan is, the life channel is always open. This isn't just a marketing tagline, but a solid safety design. The L6's iMoz 4.0 smart cockpit introduces AI agents for the first time, achieving a no touch and no APP interaction experience. What does this mean? It means you only need to say one sentence, and the AI can help you complete operations that originally required jumping between multiple apps, clicking, selecting, confirming, and paying. For example, if you say, book me a highly rated Japanese restaurant nearby, it will automatically filter restaurants, check ratings, reserve a table, and even complete payment, all in one go. Think about it. This is so much simpler than our current smartphone operations. Another feature I find very thoughtful is City Drive. Don't know where to go on weekends? Don't want to plan an itinerary? The L6 acts like your personal guide, helping you discover hidden gems and popular spots in the city. It's like bringing City Walk into your car, making urban exploration easier and more fun. The L6's rainy night mode is a true lifesaver for nighttime driving. Using intelligent sensing capabilities, it highlights potential hazards ahead on the screen during rainy nights, giving beginners the predictive awareness of seasoned drivers. The full-frame digital rearview mirror enhances and displays images from the rear and sides, offering a wider and clearer view than physical mirrors. It dynamically tracks nighttime risks, like turning on night vision in a video game, greatly improving nighttime driving safety. iMOS 4.0 isn't picky about smartphones. It instantly connects to all ecosystems, seamlessly transferring navigation, music, and calls. It can even connect to smartwatches, pre-cooling the car so you step into a comfortable temperature. This kind of effortless yet thoughtful experience is true intelligence. The L6's IMAD 3.0 Intelligent Driving Assistance features one of the world's first end-to-end -end intelligent driving large models, experienced by over 95% of Gigi users. The latest upgrade supports seamless NOA, navigation on autopilot, in cities without maps and highway ETC passage. It can identify ETC lanes, lane markings, find the best route, and automatically pass through toll gates after detecting the barrier arm lift. This means truly seamless intelligent driving assistance from city roads to highways. For parking, the L6 offers customizable parking, one-click AI valet, and one-click escape functions, effortlessly handling irregular spots in old neighborhoods and dead-end spaces in malls. The L6 collaborates with London's Central St. Martin's College, integrating haute couture design concepts into the car. The 27-degree coupe line flows from the roof to the small ducktail, forming a cohesive design. Whether you're in formal wear, casual attire, or sports gear, this car perfectly complements your style. The L6 comes in six artistic colors, each inspired by art. Matisse Red, inspired by the passionate works of Fauvis master Henri Matisse. 
Ari's Black. Deep and performance-packed, ideal for urban low-key power players. Raphael T. Warm and refined, a declaration of character for workplace elites. Nevis Blue. Pure like the lakes beneath snowy mountains, full of healing vibes. Ferdinand Pink. Gentle yet not overly sweet. A pink even tough guys can pull off. Mirandi Purple. Newly released, a dreamy gray-toned purple. One of Pantone's trending colors for 2025 to 2026. The interior adopts an earth tone gray theme, elegant and warm. Each door features heartstrings and resonance art decorations by emerging artists, turning the cabin into a mobile art gallery. The L6's chameleon intelligent light language system includes a trendy scrolling tail light that displays pet party icons, autonomous driving prompts, and festive patterns for birthdays and New Year. Most practically, it can show a thank you message when letting others merge, promoting civilized driving. The instant sensing anti-UV sunroof is true sun protection technology, blocking 99.99% of UV rays across all wavelengths. Ordinary sunroofs only block UV below 380 nanometers, but the L6 protects against all UVA and UVB rays under 400 nanometers, preventing sunburn tanning, and aging. It can switch transparency in 0.1 seconds, offering 10 levels of light transmission adjustment and front-rear zone-specific shading. Shade during the day, stargaze at night, one sunroof, two experiences. The L6's space is surprisingly generous, with both front and rear seats, offering cross-legged freedom. The rear seat width reaches 1,350 millimeters, and headroom is nearly one meter. All models come with a driver's bagel-shaped pressure relief system, featuring three adjustable cushion stiffness levels and eight-point spa-grade massage to ease fatigue. The front passenger seat includes space seating that can connect with the rear seats to form a chaise lounge. The rear seats support a 37-degree reclining angle and eight-point spa-grade massage. The sound system boasts 21 speakers with Hanxian Ethereal Intelligent Sound Field, complemented by four-door double-layer soundproof glass and RNC active noise cancellation, peak noise reduction over 10 decibels, delivering an exceptional auditory experience. In terms of storage, the L6 offers 25 storage spaces throughout the car. The IM Mac Magnetic Expansion Dock 2.0 transforms the cabin into a versatile space. The liftback tailgate design, paired with easy loading mode, perfectly solves the loading challenges of fastback sedans. After reviewing the L6's full capabilities, I have to say it truly redefines what a 200,000 RMB electric car should be. From the Lynxy digital chassis to the tire blowout stability control, from the AI agent to the instant anti-UV sunroof, the L6 showcases the powerful innovative capabilities of China's automotive industry in the era of electric intelligence. It doesn't simply borrow elements from luxury cars, but truly builds a product that surpasses its class from the ground up. No wonder it managed to secure 30,000 orders in such a short time. This is the market's recognition of genuine quality. Now I want to ask you, if you had a budget of 250,000 RMB, which version of the L6 would you choose? The Ultra version? A performance beast? The Pro Max version? A range champion? Or would you go for the entry-level Max version and customize it yourself? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comment section. Also. Who do you think is L6's biggest competitor? Is it the BYD Han, the Xpeng P7, or the Li Auto L7? In the next episode, we'll bring a detailed comparison of these models to see where their strengths lie. If you enjoyed this episode, don't forget to like, subscribe to Volt China, and turn on the notification bell. We'll continue to bring you the latest in Chinese electric vehicles and technological innovations. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.